Hey everyone, my name is Wafa. I'm a watercolor artist and also enjoy travel vlogging. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. I would love to have you on my channel. If you've seen my videos from before, you know that my best friend Arthi lives in Colorado for school right now. And I found another excuse to visit her this weekend. We're going to be exploring Breckenridge. So just keep watching and I hope you enjoy. Breckenridge. This is a place Arthi and her boyfriend Michael have raved about. It's called Slice Works. Smells so good. Oh my god. Officially on our way to Breckenridge. It's a late night drive, so there probably won't be much to see. We are pulling into the Airbnb neighborhood and it is literally feeling like Christmas time. The names of the area is all Christmassy, like Snowflake Drive. You can't see anything really, but we are going down these stairs. It's creepy but like beautiful. Yeah, we have to figure this out, but this is what it looks over. That's cool. That is cool. Guys, it's not gonna be worth showing you outside right now because it's so dark, but we entered through here and then this is what the living space looks like and then the kitchen's obviously back there. Okay, this is a guest services directory, which is cute of them. Nice thing about this is there's a bathroom here Hello. And there's another bathroom in this master room, which is nice. And then this is the bed. And do I want to open this? I'm a little scared. Oh my God, this is locked. <laughs> What's behind this door? <laughs> Here's the neighborhood in the day. That's the house. little town and there are mountains everywhere guys this Starbucks looking real cute looking so cute there's also a place called Mountain View coffee bar but we don't want to experiment so this is like how you go down the stairs to get to the Airbnb so at night I showed this, obviously it looked very creepy, slash you could not see it. And that's the hot tub. The front door is actually a glass door, so it feels more like a backyard door, which is interesting. We're at the biking spot. We're gonna bike on a trail from, what's the trail from? Breckenridge to Frisco, so let's go see what the situation is. We reserve these bikes in advance. Just getting signed up. Guys, we're on the bike ride, and look at how beautiful this creek is that we're just biking along. It's so pretty out here. Like just immediately beautiful. And look, right behind me are mountains. Look at all the snowy mountains. Look at this little bike park. How beautiful is this and the colors of the homes. 
so pretty. Not recommending videoing and biking kids. Not recommending that. Pack this out. So awesome. I'm sorry for the shaky footage. That looks like a school we're coming across, but little beds of water, like green all around us. Oh wow, look at that mountain. It's beautiful. Just want to like be in there. So it was really hard to hear us with the original audio because it got so windy. But basically what I'm saying here is that the combination of it being uphill with the wind made it really difficult for us to bike, so we did walk a little bit on the way back. It's a lot. Oh my gosh, look at that beautiful creek, you guys. Wow. Sir. Made it back, so shocked to the bike shop, like, wow. That uphill coming back to Breckenridge is literally no joke. Crazy. And the high winds, it was just a lot. But we're super excited because we're gonna go for lunch now. Soup's on is the first place. And then Dugan's, and Dugan's Deli. And Dugan's Deli is the second place. Um, this local guy at the bike shop just raved about it. So we're so excited. Got the mountains here. And then we've got our soup place right here. This is the jalapeno cheddar bread at Supon's. Good? Mm -hmm. Just wanted to point out that Dugan's Deli is like downstairs of this ski rental and summit rentals. It's kind of hard to find. So this is the Dugan's uh, Cabana Boy sandwich and it's actually pretty freaking good. And it looks like the chili is the favorite of the other place, soup on. So we're going out to the hot tub. The hot tub is jetting. We are about to get turned in this hot tub right now with our candy. Like this is the hot tub and then we have the mountain view right there. So it looks so freaking cool. So we just picked up dinner from a place called Chinese Szechuan. And this is mine. It's the vegetable lo mein. Arthi's is chicken lo mein. And then we got Cinnabon balls from Taco Bell. And then I got a Frosty from Wendy's. So we went all out for dinner. It's another day. Uh, you might be able to tell my nose and top part of my forehead got burnt. So wear your sunscreen, you guys. We're closer up to the sun out here in Colorado. got the mountains here and then you've got noodles and company our lunch spot right there this looks like it's for two people but it's for me i love noodles and company so much we do not have it in texas anymore we're on the way to sapphire point overlook and this road here it looks really nice just looking to the right here we are guys the sapphire point overlook at white river national forest it's already incredible. Hi. 
how beautiful is that? The way the snow reflects the sun off the mountains is beautiful. I don't know if you guys can see those acorns on the trees. I don't know what you call those. Pine needles or I don't know what it is. But they look so beautiful on those trees. And then we've got squirrels everywhere. And they're such cute ones. They're sitting on these rocks and looking out. And they look so small compared to their background. It's like a little cartoon movie. Look at them. Do you see why they call it Sapphire Point? The water is literally sparkling. How cool is that? It's glistening water. All right guys, we were in the wrong parking area. We're now in the right parking area. This is where the troll is. At the start of the Illinois Creek Trailhead. All right, let's find him. Love this. So this is the way back, but I wanted to give you guys one more look. And then this was the path we came into. Bye, Mr. Troll. We're here at what looks like the Blue Lakes Trailhead. Really beautiful. Oh my God, it's scary. Because the sun's about to go down in a couple of hours. Some parts are unfrozen, but it is mostly frozen. This is the trail. Just look up to the side and, wow, that looks crazy. Our goal is to get to this one fence where you're supposed to see some lake. Lake is a very worthwhile trail to do. Um, it would, it's beautiful. The audio got really bad here because of the wind, but basically this is the main viewpoint. We got to get really up close to the snowy mountain, so we really enjoyed this part of the trail. Guys, these rocks, I think you can tell, they are different colors. It looks like green, orange, red, just beautiful. driving down 70 East Highway. Well, we can see it. Let me actually get out of the car. So this is the highway, right? Like right here. And we see this scenic overlook. So right off the highway is this scenic overlook. How incredible is that?
Good morning, everyone. Arthi looks like she's being tortured, but <laughs> this is our last morning in the hot tub. It's our last day today, and we just got everything packed and out of the Airbnb. When we leave our Airbnb, we get this view right away, which has been really nice. Last time we're gonna see it like this. So here we are, where we are seeing Main Street, a block away from us right now. This is where everything is looking real cute. The houses are colorful. They look like they're from another time period. Every time there's an opening, you can see just how cute it is. Oh my goodness. Look at that. I'm so excited because we're actually gonna get to walk on Main Street right now to get to our brunch spot. Yeah, the apple croissant. Yeah. That's that? Yeah. This is the back of the restaurant, or the bakery I should say, and look, we've got a little bit of a water flow situation here. Looks good. I'm sure it's cute at night with the lights. This looks so good. This is the omelet and the croissant. That's the panini. That is really good. This is legitimately my favorite food that we've had so far in Breckenridge. So on point. The tomato tastes so fresh. The pesto tastes so fresh. Look at that part. It's like, that's the view of the mountain. And then Main Street. We're doing the Sawmill Reservoir hike right now. People are zip lining there. Over there. I just heard them say it's one of the best in Colorado. Had an incline and the breathing getting tough. A lot of narrow trees. Oh my gosh. It's actually really nice. Oh, the water here is sparkling too. Different colors. Oh, it's cute. It's cute. This is actually the mountain we were seeing from the hot tub. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty. Yeah. Really pretty views. Look at how apparent the rocks are. Like you can really see through the water, which is really neat. Pretty nice chilling spot. Sorry for the abrupt ending with the last thing I did in Breckenridge, but I am back in Austin now. I will possibly be going back to Colorado next weekend, but it's to go on a road trip. So if you guys enjoyed this travel vlog, please like and subscribe, and I will see you for the next one. Thank you again for watching. Bye.